Hey guys, it's iFact5901 and I've been asked to make a video on how to use console command for Dragon Age Origins. It's very, very easy to do. Um, the first thing that you want to do is go to this website right here. Type in www.dragonagenexus.com It'll bring you to this home page here. I highly recommend you guys to register with them because some of these mods will have adult content and you won't see it prop up when you search for it. So you know register with them signed in and you want to sign in anyway if you like the mod endorse these modders help you know help them out help support them but um, once you get all that done come down here to file search click on the, the little name section here and just type in the AO mod manager which I already have typed in now here once you finish typing all that in, go to go, and it will bring you to this page right here. And this is the mod that you want to download. This is the manual. It will tell you in detail description on how to use this program uh, and everything in detail if you want to you know, read through all that. And this is basically the uh, collection of dot .override files that he got for his personal use and he's sharing it with everyone but you can do that later once you get this mod manager go ahead and click that one once you get to this page here you have um, some options to do this is the description tab it'll tell you um, everything about this particular mod what works with it and everything like these are the ready to go mods that will work with it like the the natural body um, 1.0 this, this is the all-in-one you know, it's very, very easy. Uh, these people, these monitors make everything easy to use. And this is the, the guide I was telling you about, the manual. You can download that. These are all the features that this particular mod has. It will tell you how to install it. Everything, just unzip it, you know, to your computer. And just open up it, the folder and just double click on the execute how to install it, these are the updates, it will tell you everything that you need to know about this particular mod. And if you like it, you know, you want to to endorse this right here. I'm not exactly sure why he has 10 thumb down for this mod. It's very nice. Um, I don't know what the hell these people are thinking. I don't know. There's always haters out there. But, um, you know, you can go to the comment section here. As you can see, this person here just endorsed it. This person has a question right there. But anyway, um, if you have any questions or whatever, just come in here and ask them. But um, go ahead and click on the file, download the latest one. I'm not sure which particular uh, version of the game you have, but I'm pretty sure the newest one will work with any versions. Uh, and if it doesn't work, come download these older ones down here. Just go ahead and click download, and this will prop up. Um, depending on which web browser you're using, it's going to be different. Um, this one will have this prop up. Just go ahead and click download file, and it should open up in a second here. It should ask you if you want to open the folder, save it, or whatever. Um, just go ahead and save it onto your desktop, which I already have a copy save up here, right there, you know, and then just extract it wherever you want, which I already have, you know, this thing extracted and everything. Once you have everything extracted, just click on that one right there, the mod manager execute, and this will open up right here. Now, I'll, I'll, if you guys want to know how to install mods on this particular program, I'll show you. But the purpose of this video is just show you how to use the console command. So basically, just open this up right here. Come down here and go to Run. And you want to start Dragon Age with console. You can even start it with the two set, config, or run the game without any console command. Now, and for you to, to look at, up these cheat codes, you want to go to your um, search engine and just type in Dragon Age PC Cheats and it will bring up to a page like this depending on you know which search engine you're using it won't look exactly like this unless you're using the same search engine as I am but um, I usually just go to the gamespot.com here go ahead and click the link 
and it should bring you up to this page right here and it will give you a whole list of console commands right here like this one right here add experience add money and you can even add party members you can drop party members you can switch your classes down here very very easy to do so anyway I'm gonna show you how to um, use the console command right now um, just go ahead and click run start Dragon Age with console I don't know how fast this is gonna be since I'm recording this with Camtasia here uh, but we'll see come on come on come on there we go okay now just go ahead and load one of your save games I'm gonna have to make sure I'm loading a game without any nudity as you can see I have a whole lot of um, save games here um, this is my newest character mage uh, I don't yeah I think she does have a little nudity so uh, it might not show so I'm gonna go ahead and press save if it does show I'll just kinda edit that a little bit here okay once you get control of your character um, oh good no nudity okay so once you get control of your character here press the till button is right next to the one above the tab and you'll see this right arrow here I have a mod that shows what I'm typing if you don't have that mod it won't show exactly what you're typing um, let's let's start with something easy here um, uh, let's say I want to add approval points for Alistair I already know the codes for that so you want to type in run script space zz underscore add approval space Alistair is one space I want to add 10 points of approval press enter bam Alistair now have plus 10 approval points okay let's just say that you want to add attribute skill or whatever I have this other mod that makes console command much much easier because um, if you want to do it the regular way let's see if I can find it here to add attributes and stuff like that um, run AI abilities nope let's see where the heck is it did I pass it there we go see this right here this will add a skill you'll have to look up what kind of skill you want to add to it is like certain numbers of this skill and stuff like that but I think I already passed it up here let's see what I can add this is basically add gifts this is to, to remove a talent you know you like I said you have to find the numbers for it but anyway like I said I, I have this mod to make things easier so press the till again and press the arrow up it will show you the last thing that you put in here so I wanna erase all that here and I'm gonna say give talent 10 bam now I have 10 talent points added let's say I wanna add attribute so I wanna type in run script space give ATTRIB space 10. Now I have 10 attribute points added to my character. Uh, but you know, the console command is very, very easy to use. So um, it depends on what kind of you know cheats you want to add. Let's just say I want to um, switch my character class. She is a mage right now. So you want to type in run script. I want to be a warrior so just type in warrior uh, I think I typed warrior wrong there run script rogue bam now my character is a rogue now you probably want to be careful with this when you do this sometimes whatever you have in your inventory it will delete everything but um, fortunately it didn't delete all the stuff that I had here and now my character is a level 2 rogue 
and that is how you use console command if you have any more questions um, let me know I'll be more than happy to help and um, you know hopefully this video will help if you guys want to know how to install these mods with this uh, DAO mod manager I will make a video of it if it's you know requested but anyway um, appreciate you guys watching like I said any more questions let me know I'll be more than happy to help so see ya